In one of my previous videos, I spoke about how you can customize your own tinted lip balm from the screen. If you've not seen that video, I'm going to have it linked up. Make sure you check it out. So today, I'm going to be showing you how to make your own tinted lip balm at home. We just see it with So hi guys, my name is Olu Chikaroline. If you're tuning in for the very first time, you're very welcome. Please do not make it your last time. So the first thing you're going to be needing is a Vaseline, obviously. The basic Vaseline is going to work perfectly fine. Now the second thing you're going to be needing is a lipstick or a lip palette. Whatever works for you, whatever you're comfortable with or whatever it is that is your favorite. So I have this um, lip palette from the Charm Ageless Cosmetics and I've been using that. So that is what I am going to use today. You can make use of your lipstick. Just do everything I did for now with your lipstick. Alright, so get your mixing plate, get your mixing bowl, um, you're going to be working with it. Add about 2 scoops of the vast meat to your mixer. Now according to the quantity you want to go for, you can either go higher or you can go lower with yours. I added about 2 scoops and that is okay for me. Alright, so just do whatever you want, um, play around with it, go with whatever quantity you, you want. So yeah now get your lipstick or your lip palette i am going to be working with this pink and again you can work with whatever color you want whatever it is you're going for that is totally up to you okay so i'm going to add about this little to my last name just about this little i don't need like that much this little is okay okay and as usual, you can go higher, you can go lower. It's totally dependent on you and the quantity you want to achieve, the quantity you're going for. So once you're done adding your lipstick to your last lip, the next thing you're going to be doing is double boiling. Please do not place on direct heat. And again, please boil on very low heat, all right? Because it doesn't even take time to dissolve. Now you want to keep stirring and mixing till it is all properly mixed. Do not overheat, just make sure it fully dissolves and then it's fully mixed together. Okay, so keep stirring, keep mixing till everything comes together, everything mixes together and then you are done. So once it is fully dissolved and mixed, you're going to have to set it down from the fire. And please do not wait for this thing to cool. Just do it immediately. You cut it down. Okay. So you're going to the next thing you're going to need is another container. Whatever it is you want to add um, your balm into. I'm going to be using these small um, containers. So get whatever it is you want to use. Make sure this thing is still hot and warm, like straight out of fire when you are doing this. No wait for it to cool down. So scoop it into the container you want to use, whatever quantity you want, whatever amount you want. Scoop it into the container and then set it aside, okay? So as you can see, I have two containers, meaning I'm, I'm going to be making like two of these all right so in my next one i'm going to add peppermint oil peppermint oil is going to basically give it this um minty and tingling effect so it's going to circulate it's going to promote blood circulation on your lips and then give you this um plumping and fuller lips yeah so after i've added like few drops of peppermint oil i'm going to scoop it into another container into another container you can see it's already like um cooling and solidifying so you have you want to be very fast with this thing just scoop it into your container cover it and set it aside Now once you're done scooping in, once you're done transferring into the container of your choice, you have to cover it and set it aside. Now you can choose to refrigerate this so it's going to hasten up um, the freezing, the solidifying process or you can just leave it 
for a couple of minutes it's going to also solidify so whatever it is you want to do here is totally up to you put it in the fridge or set it aside in a very cool place to solidify either ways it is going to solidify so once you're done just leave it for a couple of minutes it's okay a couple of minutes it's fine totally fine and yeah now once it is fully solidified get it out you can see how mine is looking um, it is not even spilling even as i turned it so you want it to be that solidified okay yeah so look at how it looks all beautiful or oh, and the pink is really pinking the pink is really pinking um this is not a pink lips balm this is just a moisturizing um lip balm that just to moisturize your lips and tint it a little bit it is not going to make your lips very pink all right so as you can see you just made use of your fasting and your lipstick no added chemicals nothing just what you know what you have so in the next video i'm going to be showing you how i use hi guys it. so i currently do not have anything on my lips currently i don't have even a single thing on my lips so we're going to be trying out the lip balm i just made just to show you guys how good and how moisturizing it is okay i really hope you guys can hear me because clearly i'm outside and there are cars and bikes passing even generator sounds but hopefully my, my uh, hopefully my mic is working perfectly and yeah so this is the first one we're going to be trying out the one without the peppermint yeah so look at how it is inside fully solidified and all of that i'm going to be taking Can you see how this is very, very moisturizing? I mean, so compared to how my lips were before, I really hope you guys can even catch a glimpse of how this thing has fairly moisturized and even added color to my lips. All right, yeah. So. This is really beautiful you guys this is really beautiful and i'm going to use this for a very long time thank god i made two so you have to try this you should try this i mean you should try it let me clean up this one right and we're going to try out the one with the peppermint all right So everything is gone and kind of tinted my lips kind of tinted my lips a bit yep kind of tinted my lips a bit which is actually very cool and beautiful right so let's try out the peppermint one let's try out the one with the peppermint okay so this is the one with the peppermint this is the one with the peppermint in case in case you want that you know plumping effect like you want your lips to get a bit plumpy you know what i think there was a challenge that was going on then that people use um pepper at Tarodo to you know plump up their lips the peppermint in this one is going to help you with that you don't need to subject yourself to that hell so we're gonna apply this one now let's see so i'm going to take I don't know how you guys survived. The people that did that pepper stuff, how did you guys survive? Because this thing is so minty. It's so minty. How does it feel on my lips? It's kind of, um, you know, 
a bit with that minty and tingling sensation yeah that's what i basically get with this one on my lips but it's okay it's going to die down in a couple of minutes and yeah it's all good i don't know guys i don't know but i am really in love with this i am really really in love with this i love this so much it's so beautiful it's such a beautiful pink it's such it's not a shouty pink it's not like a very loud pink it's very soft and subtle it looks just like your natural lips sorry guys can you see my lips i can stay here all day for this like come on look at my lips look how good my lips look compared to how it was when i started this video look how good my lips are now i mean so soft so moisturized so succulent and you know mm, very attractive i mean i mean come on and yeah i'll see you guys in my next one thank you so much guys for watching i hope you really found this very helpful i hope you enjoyed this as much as i did so if you found this video very helpful please do not forget to give it a thumbs up um leave a comment down there in the comment section for me let me know what you think about this and do you think it's really cool you think it's beautiful i know it is beautiful but let me know what you think okay and share to people you think my this video of course and most importantly subscribe to me if you've not subscribed already you guys are growing i mean thank you to all of you for sticking with me and i hope you keep growing thank you so much guys and i will see you in my next one bye guys